Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. It is SSJDK Hero, and today I'm going to be talking about DNF Duel. For the last video of 2021 on my channel. It has been a semi rough year. I don't want to say very ter very terrible. Because it wasn't. It was actually better than 2020 at least. I can say that. A friend of mine asked me if uh, this year was better than the last and I yeah I could say it was definitely um but yeah it's uh it's New Year's Eve and uh, I know I'm late wishing you guys a Merry Christmas but happy holidays and uh, I hope you got what you wanted this year and hopefully that next year you'll get what you wanted if you didn't get this year if you didn't get what you wanted this year, sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, put down in the comments below what you got this year. Uh, I'll put down in the description what I got this year because I got some pretty good stuff um, from my family as well as friends and just overall love and all that stuff like that. I I definitely wish you guys a happy holidays and stuff like that. So yeah, um, without further ado. Let's uh, get into it. So, um, DNF Duel. No, your eyes do not deceive you. That is indeed JM Crofts. And uh, I unwillingly bumped into him in the beta. That was a nice combo into Super. I unwillingly bumped into him in the beta because he put a lobby up while I was searching for one. And I was like, yeah, sure, let's get in there. He's only got... It's only just him in that lobby. So, I went in there. And, of course, every every YouTuber I've seen play this, FGC content creator I've seen play this, picks Inquisitor. And I haven't fought an Inquisitor all too much. I fought one, like, earlier in the beta, and the person that was using her didn't know what they were doing, but then again, a lot of people don't know what they're doing in this beta, so it's fine. It's part of the experience, which is what I like about DNF Duel. No training mode, just go straight into it and learn and get in there and do, do an experience combos firsthand. See what your characters can do. I love the parry or counter mechanic that uh, Grappler has. That's why, I, that's why I picked Grappler in the first place. Uh, Y'all know me. I love the characters that just throw hands. The characters that just outright say these hands are rated E for everyone. I love characters like that and that's why I picked Grappler. And uh Yeah, no. I was I was fucking him up, he was fucking me up. It was it was pretty fun. I will say though, I do have a a couple gripes with the uh beta. And um this is just from my personal um, my personal standing, no one else's. I do hate the fact that, I didn't like the fact, I won't say I hate, because I, I fucking love this fucking beta. This game will be awesome when it comes out next summer, or next year in the summer. And it's a day one buy for me. And I hope the roster is expanded before then. Um, but yeah, back to what I was saying, the, 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 a couple cons that I have with this beta is that it seems like matchmaking was region, region locked? Or region based? Because I'm in, um, I'm in the, uh, Midwest, I live in Illinois, and my friend, um, I forget where he is. I want to say Texas, but I may be wrong. No, he's not in Texas. He's somewhere else, but I do want to say that um, I'm in the Midwest, and it seems like I've only I've only been connecting to people in the Midwest um, almost all the time during this beta, which is nice because it keeps the the net code and the network stable, uh, except for that one match I had um, earlier in the beta where this guy was like. <laughs> skipping around and just overall laggy. That was the first laggy match. I may post that clip on um, YouTube if I get the chance. 
Yeah, I'm doing the uh, conversion mechanic that I saw on YouTube earlier before I had this match with him. He's he JM Crofts knows what he's doing. He's mixing people up and stuff. He's finding his buttons. I actually did go to his stream and I did watch what um after the fact, not before the fact. Um after the fact I did go to his stream and I did watch the reactions from the chat. People calling me nutty <laughs> and people calling me crazy. And some people commending my playstyle, some people commending Grappler's playstyle overall. Um, yeah, it was just, it was just fun. I, I was definitely desperate. I was super desperate. Uh, that's why I kept doing jump-in combos. I just really wanted to see these combos. These combos looked great. I just love the fact that Grappler can just ignore most of the damage. And, um, albeit the, uh, the next gripe I have with this game, um, the next gripe I have with this game is that full screen combos, they're, ooh, playing Grappler and getting full screen comboed, as in the last, uh, recent video that I posted before this one, I was fighting against Vanguard, I think that was his name. And yeah, holy crap, I could not get in against that guy um, for a while now. I actually think he won that set. Also, this is a first of five between me and JM. And again, it was fun. I was, we were both just, both just pretty much fucking around. Obviously, obviously he was trying, he, he and I both were trying to look good. So, it was, it was just a mess. <laughs> <laughs> it was just a mess on my part. <laughs> I, um... I like it. I like this game a lot. But, the positives I have with this game... It's very, it's very fun. I've mentioned it again. It's very fucking fun. This game is sick. Again, again, I'm buying it day one when it comes out. Like, no lie. I may pre-order it. Shoot, that's how much I like it. Um... Yeah, combat, the mechanics, the flow of the uh, netcode, it's its its just spot on. I like it. I don't know if it's rollback netcode or not. I don't know if it's rollback or delay based netcode. I think it is rollback netcode because I'm looking at the under my health bar and I see rollback frames. So yeah, it may be rollback netcode. But um... Oh yeah, that was that was nice from uh, Jam Crops. But yeah, no. Um, I do like the um, responsiveness of the netcode. It was nice. It was nice getting into this beta and having no issues. Oh yeah, another another gripe. I'm sorry, but um, this is the third gripe I had with the game or the beta. It would kick you out sometimes, just just cause the beta would just kick you out sometimes and put you back in the main menu and it, it'll make you think that it's your fault <laughs> like you couldn't connect to the network it was just not good to be mid-match and being kicked out like that definitely not fun but again it is an open beta and it's still pretty early and things are subject to change so I'm not gonna hold it against them like like everyone else should you should not hold it against them. Any of these bugs or glitches or um, anything that you encounter in this beta, don't hold it against them. Just, it's still a beta. When the full game comes out, obviously it will perform better. We'll see. But uh, another positive thing that I liked about this game are the characters. The characters, the characters look great. Ranger has... Ranger looks great, Inquisitor looks great, Grappler, Grappler looks damn good. They all play, every character is fun. Every character is fun. I did get a chance to play every character, but obviously I've played Grappler the most. I am definitely going to be a Grappler main until they bring out another, like, CQC character. I know Striker is in the game, I don't know if I'll play Striker, we'll see. She hasn't really impressed me as much as Grappler, 
But I have fought against strikers, and yeah, they, they do know what they're doing. And, uh... She just, she just overall just has, like, a bunch of rushdown combos. So, shoot, she probably gets in better than Grappler. Anyone can argue with me on that in the comments. She, she definitely can get in. Grappler... Grappler has this, like, run... Run speed... Where he like builds up run speed. First he starts off slow, then he starts getting faster and faster as he's running um, across the screen. I have yet to test that out, but yeah, it's great. Um, another thing I've noticed most uh, YouTubers talking about is the feel and the and the comparisons that they make to other fighting games with DNF Duel. Um, a lot of people saying it plays like. Uh, Grand Blue. A lot of people saying it plays like Street Fighter V almost. I don't see Street Fighter V <laughs> being compared to this game, to be honest. I have seen some people comparing it to Street Fighter V. Um, some people are saying it's a watered-down Marvel vs. Capcom almost. It's like... People are saying it's compared to... Guilty Gear, and I feel like Guilty Gear is the close is the closest comparison to this type of game. It's it's kind of slow, like Guilty Gear Strive. There's air combos, there's guard breaks, there's guard cancels. There's uh, I haven't, albeit I haven't played Guilty Gear Strive. I don't know the first thing about Guilty Gear Strive. I should hop on Guilty Gear Strive, like a lot of people are telling me to, but I'm waiting. <laughs> I am I am waiting for it to do its thing. I'm waiting on a full a full release of Guilty Gear Strive. I don't know if it's still getting content or not. Yeah, look at these glorious mix-ups by JM Crofts. He I I should I should have known that uh I wasn't going to be able to keep a a uh, win streak on this guy. And then, um, this was also during the time, during this match, I didn't know how to guard cancel or, uh, push back people or get people off you, which is definitely a mechanic that you need against a character like this that just keeps throwing shit out and keeps you blocking. Definitely need, uh, to learn the guard break or guard cancel, not guard break, guard cancel. Um, which is which is what a lot of people have trouble with actually that guard cancel is sometimes not responsive See yeah, I got it there, and then after that I never got it again. <laughs> I Love the conversion mechanic you can you can turn white health into meter if you have it But you got to be careful because sometimes your white health will be um um, diminished if you get critical hit or critical hit against as you can see I'm, I'm trying to do I'm trying to do the full grappler combo that um, I've learned in my last video excuse me and yeah he's close to winning he's got like one more win on his belt game point I I think around here I like turned it up to 11 like I was no no I'm not going to I'm not going to die like that. <laughs> I'm not going to go out like that. That's exactly what I kind of did. I just started using the um armor armored up moves or hyper armor moves because I really wanted to get in. Like I said earlier, I was desperate, super desperate. I really wanted to get in. And um, and he just he just kept saying no. <laughs> JM Crofts just kept saying no. So it was like, yeah, time to just turn it up to eleven. See what I could do. Yep, get the uh, raw grab in, and I died. <laughs> yeah, no, like I said, it was it was very fun. Playing against JM Crofts. That's my first time playing against JM Crofts ever. I've been a fan of his YouTube channel for a while now. There's a couple YouTube channels that I've been a fan of and I've interacted with. Not interacted with, but had matches against. Uh, one of them being Maximilian. 
back on um, PS3 Third Strike or Third Strike Online, which is honestly the best version of that game. And getting to play against Maximilian in, in PS3 Third Strike was fucking awesome. Albeit he won, I won the first match and he won the second match. Um, I decided to pick. I decided to pick black and gold Ryu against this Dudley, and I got fucked up. But the first match I had Akuma, and yeah, I parried his rose. Anyway, off subject. <laughs> yeah, this game looks. Sick. Look at all that, fucking. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. All the effects look flashy, the combos are just... Combos do a shit ton of damage and I love it. I'm actually okay with it. I'm more... I'm more comfortable with the... The, um... Slower paced fighting games? Almost slower paced fighting games? Fighting games like this one, I love the, the slow pace of Street Fighter V, Mortal Kombat 11... It, it, the list just goes on of how many slower paced fighting games I like. They're, they're pretty awesome because it gives you a chance to gives you a chance to like look at your opponent and download them a little bit and I actually did take that I actually, I actually did take that <laughs> I don't know if you can hear the commentary in the background but uh yeah that is me getting hype and if you can hear it awesome if you can't I'm sorry I was trying to record my audio over this audio but I want you guys to hear it firsthand how hype I was to fight a fight against JM Crofts and um, don't mind my friend he's he's playing something totally different if you hear him as well that's Duke he know who he is um, I think he was playing something else at the time but, uh, other than that, yeah, no, these matches were, these matches were the most intense, intense matches for me and the, uh, the last YouTube video that I posted, uh, regarding this game. Vanguard and Inquisitor definitely are my favorite matchups so far. And I will agree with someone in the comments of JM Croft's stream, how they said that, um, I think they were, I don't know if they were talking about me. Or they were just talking about the character Grappler in general, but they were talking about how it turns out that uh, either me or the character is not used to set play or something like that. I don't remember what the uh, actual comment was, but I can agree. I can agree. A lot of... If he's talking about the character, I will say that a lot of low attacks do hurt Grappler a lot because his most of his counters and his overheads are high or mid, and low attacks just yeah, as you saw there, a counter. Low attacks just fucking destroy this character. But but uh, as you can see, <laughs> I am doing my thing with this character. I am very nutty. I am very desperate. It shows that I'm very desperate. Um, in this like, in this last, I think this is the last match. But yeah, no, I I get very desperate. I get mixed up because I'm desperate, and he starts to do the do the critical hits more. Take my white health away from me. Ooh, that was a nice dash over my command grab. I should have conversed there. But. Wasn't thinking about it at the moment. Oh my god, I'm in pain. That's a super. I am a dead man indeed. But yeah, no, I hope you guys are enjoying these types of videos. And if you are... Please let me know in the comments, leave a like on the video, or a dislike. Any feedback is good feedback, and I'll accept any or pretty much 
relative feedback to the channel. It helps me improve. It helps me stay motivated to bring videos to the channel and and more. So, uh, albeit, thank you guys for the support this year. I appreciate it a lot. I think this year I've had the the uh, same amount of support as last year. I'm gonna, I'm hoping I could kick it up a notch and get it together because. Same as last year, or the year before that, I made the same promise and almost didn't deliver. And it's the same thing happening this year because a lot of things going on. Omicron, COVID, all that, I mean, not COVID, excuse me. Brovid. <laughs> YouTube, don't, <laughs> don't destroy my channel. I don't know why we can't talk about it on freaking YouTube. They're such babies, man. I don't know what's going on with this algorithm, but thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Have a happy new year, and to many more, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.